even made people they are in this pottery business quite a long time because when they came from that is their occupation so when they come down to Vumi, they look for clay and they start doing it. So pottery do a lot of work for Vumi people. Once you are potter, you see your friend potter, you'll be closer. Because we all learn from each other. Some things you must know, some things you must not know. So you can ask your friend potter to teach you how to do the things that you don't know. So it brings us together. We are friendly. Once we are potter, we are friendly. So in 1986, I started this work. I've trained a lot of people, a lot of youths. So now they are all in business. Those who cannot throw on the field, they are doing the slap works. They are through me. It takes about three years. They are making, learning of this pottery works is very difficult. So it takes about three years before you can call yourself a potter. The first day, they put me on the on the quill. The clay kicked me off, and he told me I have to make my hands stiff before I can hold it. I remember the most difficult pot that I've made. I've made a very big pot, and once the clay is very big, it makes me tough before I can control the clay on the field. So later on, when I finish, I could see that I have a very big pains in my body. It teach me a lot of things. Once I'm able to hold the bigger pot, what it teach me is that when I come back to do the smaller one, it's very easy for me to do it. If you make something difficult after that, you, that same thing will become easier for you. People of Vume are very, very patient. But actually, I don't know whether it is pot making who brought that patience to us. I don't know, maybe is the pot, the pot. Because before you do one pot, you have to exercise patience. Pot breaking doesn't make me feel anything because when the pot break, uh, when we didn't fire them, it has got break. We reuse it, and if it is big and break too, we use it again. So I didn't feel any bad about breaking broken pots. Mm, if I want to put it in a, our life, it's like. 
Anything that happens, you have to take it. And in our life too, anything can happen. So if it is happened like that, just exercise patience. Think over it and you can do another thing again. You can use that mistake to do a different thing, which is even more better than the mistake you did. <laughs>